understand as I tell you to What's competition? Come show me proof This God flow, this Jesus Christ That say a prayer for I sleep at night I'm still sinning, and don't be offended My dick attended for a Spanish wife This chest home and I check us niggas Ain't playing with you, no action figures What I'm supposed to do Hey guys, this is your boy Dino, okay, DLP here. Um, welcome back to some more Persona 5 Royal, guys. Um, you guys are probably wondering why I don't have the same hyped energy I usually would. It's because this week has been very, very busy, uh, work-wise. Uh, busy to the point where I've been coming home very, very late from work. Um, and uh, it's been stressing as well, I won't lie. Uh, today's my day off, you know, fortunately. You know, for most of the day, I just couldn't be asked. I was that tired from my previous days of shifts. And uh, it's been a while since I actually posted. Not actually posted, but... <coughs> <coughs> it's been a while since I've um, recorded a video, about two, three days now. And I believe it's two days, if I'm not mistaken. Um... Um, so I decided to get some Persona videos done, so yeah, uh, there you go guys, <laughs> so we're back at it now, uh, obviously we were um, called by Medjet themselves, uh, it's going to be pretty interesting to see how that works, um, I forgot, oh it's the uh, Phantom Peace group, I forgot to post the photo I took today, hey, hey not bad, right, I'm a natural at this candy photography stuff. I hope for your sake that was intended to be called candid photography. Photography, not photography. Uh, that was my Asian instincts kicking in. Um, it's a shame about the rain, but at least it meant it means today was a little more memorable. Yeah, but next time we really can't miss the fireworks. Agreed. So it was most impressive how swiftly the weather turned terrible. Perhaps one of us is simply fated to bring the rain whenever he goes. I don't know. Uh, I don't think that's me. Nice. <laughs> it's pretty healthy. Oh. Nope, I didn't. Infiltration twos. Okay. I'm gonna make some. I'm gonna make yeah. some lock picks. Why not? I need it. I need it. So. Right. Yes. Yeah. Hey, nice one. Uh, so that's two now. So as you can see, our stats are all pretty equal. I must say, three rank three on all of our stats. Well then. Okay, let's get to bed. All right. Cool. Um, wait. Is this does this mark the summer holidays now? Summer holidays have started, right? On the game, I'm pretty sure. Major is dangerous. What? Tell me. Everyone's been talking about Medjet. What the hell is it? You don't watch the news much, do you? They're an international network of hacktivist. <laughs> See what they did there. Activist, hacktivist. Okay. They target corporations doing shady business and cause chaos. The subway company server thing? That was Medjet. That was Medjet trying to find out who pulls the train out of So the guys? Ugh. No some, way. Some liken them to digital common hoods. But they snoop through emails and destroy the other. No bad than good news. Yeah, yeah, it's all a setup. It's just like a catchy set. Go, go, Phantom Thieves. <laughs> what the hell? Bet you 10k the thieves win. Uh, can the thieves win? I don't know. Uh, when are they gonna react? <laughs> Imagine those guys that claim to be modern day Robin Hoods. They dare call themselves hero after those attacks. Pfft. They're fighting Medjet next. The Phantom Thieves are amazing. I don't want to hear about justice from some shady hackers. I don't care what happens as long as it's interesting. <laughs> of course, of course. Uh, so my hair is a mess as well. Um, yeah. Oh yes, I'll go to hell. Okay, how did you do? There. Damn, I'm dead. I'm above the average. That's the, that's the real dividing line, my allow allowances. It's safe for now. I wonder what score got. I think it's a little higher than the average score. Yeah. Well, hmm. Well, it should be. Well, it should set a good example for your friends. Eh. Okay. Okay. Knowledge. Charm. Okay. So I think as our knowledge increases, uh, we'll be getting better, better grades. I'm busy. It's not like I can focus on studying. Hey, it's not my fault. My scores suck, right? <laughs> Get all quiet on me. <sighs> yeah, yeah, 
guess it is my fault. <laughs> there you go, bro. Anyways, there's something more important here. And Mishima, you want to ask me something about the internet, right? Yep, I'm going to be straight with you here. Do you know who Medjet is? <laughs> you weren't kidding about being direct. That's really easy for you. Well, I suppose the news about Medjet and the Phantom Thieves has caused quite the commotion. They started out as hackers of justice, but now they only look out for their own self-interests. That's all I know. They were the group I texted him about yesterday. I see. Nobody's sure who actually belongs to Medjet. I know. And the people who've watched my playthrough and played the original Persona 5 game would know. Dude, my hair looks like a fucking mess today. Well, it looks like things will be exciting this summer. It'll be the Phantom Thieves' world debut, no? Dude, stop. Don't worry. I'll be rooting for the Phantom Thieves. I'll get the forum mobilized as well. Yeah, Mishima does a lot, man. He now, does a lot. we're done talking here, I really must be going. I'll see you guys later. Busy man, busy man. So, that was fruitless. <laughs> I wonder if anyone else got any info. God damn! <laughs> Ryuji! Mishima was pretty useless. Come on, bro. That is fucking direct as hell, bro. Can you get anything? I tried to ask for my sister, but it seems she, as though she don't know very much of them. <laughs> she doesn't specialize in cybercrime after all. I tried looking into them, but I couldn't come up with anything. There were really just no leads. They're good at covering... Well, yeah, I mean, they're good at covering their traps and whatnot. No, opponent's truly elusive. No luck. Medjet, huh? It seems like we won't be able to deal with him by ourselves. That's <laughs> okay. I know summer vacation is due to begin next week, but I have an unfortunate announcement. We'll be holding an emergency assembly on Monday the 25th. Lord! <laughs> Please come to school that day. What? Settle down. We've had many strange incidents. The psychotic breakdowns, students being dragged into crime rings. Hence, Principal Kobayakawa has instructed all teachers to caution the student body. Okay. Well, this is inconvenient for us too, you know, having to find things to warn you about so suddenly. Cool, cool. How are you gonna find Medjin? I'm not sure, no matter how hard I look online, all I find are unreliable warners. They've carried out corporate terrorism, yet they still manage to elude arrest somehow. Carnage should was a lot of trouble, but this is turning out to be a much greater ordeal. The big bite of more than we, achieve, than we can achieve. Hmm. They're too big. That's what she said. I'm sorry. Yeah. We don't even know whether it's a single individual or a large conglomerate of people. I don't even know how to say that. And even if we do manage to get a lead, what do we do from there? Damn, this stuff's really not going so good. That's probably why my exams are going to shit too. You know, those are two separate things, right? <laughs> oh man, I love Ryuji, man. Ryuji's joke. Damn, this stuff's really not going so good. <laughs> okay. Clues on Medjet, huh? Whoop! <laughs> okay. She'll be a vital character mm. in the near future. Uh, if we can't identify her, there's nothing we can do. Let's wait until they. Okay, let's wait until they make a move. I haven't checked my thieves and in God knows how long. I've been troubled. What are we doing today? I've changed my hours. LOL! Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that the fortune telling guy? Can we start during the day since you're a student? Can't do it when it rains though since we have to be outside. Come during the day for your fortune and night for the test. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So to increase the ranking of a confident, we go at the night, and during the day is where we go to actually ask for our fortune to do stuff like more money or improving relationships with people. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Okay, I, I don't mind that. That's actually pretty cool. Um. Rokoro will rank up on bone. Takumi will definitely rank up. Wait, Takumi is actually rank 6, isn't she? Meaning, uh, I can get her to rank... Yeah, 
rank 7 and we'll be getting the discounts. Uh, Salvation Wish uh, allows backup members to earn the same XP as the current point. Wow. Okay. Wow. Oh, whoa. That's a bit nutty. That's a bit nutty. What the heck? Okay. Uh, that's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. That's pretty cool. Uh, oh, now the counselor uh, persona has got his flow. I've uh, got the rest of the stars. Okay. Flow boost. Um, Ultra Star, uh, Magician, Ace Tools allows you to craft all infiltration tools. Uh, Priestess, follow up, chance to perform a follow up attack if Joker's attack does not down the enemy. That's good. Uh, okay, uh, money reading, uh, team booster. I want to go to the alleyway. I want to go to the alleyway. Uh, the discounts are needed. Discounts are needed, guys. I'm not gonna lie. The discounts are needed. <laughs> so uh, when I do buy stuff for the palaces and whatnot, it does really help. Um, don't pass out, okay? It's been getting hotter, huh? How's your health? Don't forget to stay hydrated. I don't want you to collapse when you take my medicine. So what are you here for today? I'm gonna do a clinical trial. It's almost complete. There's something I want to test out. Can you head to the back? I feel like I can come closer to talk me thanks to the death persona. No, 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 no way, no way. I think I feel like my bond will talk me more stronger soon. That's good. <laughs> thanks to you that I was able to progress this far. Now, okay, now you can drink this stuff with no problem, right? I don't know. What can I have to find out? Well, I'm just drinking water, guys. Don't worry. I suppose. Volvic strawberry sugar free. <laughs> Alright, that's it for today. Oh, are you going home already? If you have some time, why don't you stay and enjoy an apple? <clears throat> it's a gift from one of my elderly patients. She gave me a lot. Hello, Mr. Takami. Oh, Dr. Takami, I mean, not Mr. Chief for your mother. Ah, oh, this prick. Yep, I know. There was a medical, uh, med yeah, there was a medical conference nearby, so I thought I'd check up on you. Who's this? He doesn't look like a patient. Oh. He's a part time staffer. I'm having him handle some. Okay. Task for me. So, do you have some business with me? <clears throat> I hear you stole one of my patients and get with them. Stole one of my patients, of course, of course. Why do doctors have this sort of mentality that when a patient that's with you stops coming to you because they hear about another doctor that's doing well, so they want to go and check up on that doctor to see, to get a second opinion, the doctor ends up thinking, oh, the other doctor stole my patient away from me. Why do they think that? She came out with her father. <sighs> Uh, well, I had no intention of taking her from me. I certainly don't encourage her to visit my clinic. Now, there's talk that the care at a university hospital is inferior to that of a general practitioner. Original medicine. Ha! What are you doing here is simply absurd. You're right. I would have turned a blind eye if you had just run away out in this little town. But this is your final warning. Shut this place down and resign your... Shut up! Nah, nah. Don't let, her, don't let, don't let him talk like that. He's a great doctor. Please be quiet. This is harassment, you know? Like, fuck you. What did he say? <laughs> hey, don't worry about it. Nah, that's just pure harassing. Dude, what What can she do if someone comes to visit her that was your patient before? It's not like she asked. It's not like she was like, oh yeah, come to my house. Come to my clinic. I'm better than him. No, she never did that. <laughs> she was just doing her own shit. And if they came on their own accord, accord then there's no problem, right? <laughs> This guy's just too salty, man. He's, he's, you know what it is? He's jealous because she's better. <laughs> or he feels inferior to her. Hmm, you seem quite fond of her. Perhaps I should reveal this woman's true identity. She's a monster who tortured a patient with like, unregulated medicine. Terrible, isn't it? She was such a brave girl, always mine. What does this mean? It was. She passed away. What? Wait, I... Perhaps you suffered the same fate. Haha, <laughs> she used to play after all. I can't remember this part in the original story, I'll be honest. I'm pretty sure it's the same story line of the confidence, but damn, I can't remember that part. <laughs> I'll be honest. <sighs> Don't lie to me, she should have, She should, She should. still have some time. She was still only recovering, and condition couldn't have deteriorated that quickly. <clears throat> but it did. I must have misjudged. Now back to the reason why I'm here. Don't ever take another patient away from me. He, dude, he, she did it. <laughs> they came on their own accord. You don't want to make me angry. Oh, shut up and get the fuck out of here. Oh, God. 
Yep, she's she's broken up. What are your chances? No. No, no, no. But she's all I've been working towards all this time. Curing her was my only. There's no way. Let's ask for details. We don't know what's what's gone down. Because we need to know the details. <laughs> Why have I been doing all this time? What was even the point? I can't. I would retaliate, but then again, I have. I guess me and Joker have a sense of retaliating a lot in this game. So, uh, just rest for today. Anything I can do? Let's retaliate. Yeah. Retaliate. <laughs> Go on, girl. You know. Sorry. I feel bad now. Thanks for your help, man. Thanks for your help, my little guinea pig. Okay. No, let's. Re yeah, we're we'll retaliating. Okay. Decreases the prices for all items sold at the clinic. Best, best. One of the right. best abilities I've had. Like she's probably one of the best confidence because her items and then this come on top of it makes it perfect. I don't know what to say. Uh, I wish I hadn't shown you that side of me. We all do sometimes. We all do. <laughs> yeah, you're alright. I guess it's fine once in a while. Go on home for today. We will continue this another time. I feel like my cooperation in that shitty clinic has increased my guts. Only one. Only one. So <laughs> it's fine. Um, cool. Take care. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Okay, it's now the evening. Uh, Summer's break soon, back. right? Must be nice being a student. <laughs> That's true! So I looked into Medjed. Did he find anything? As you know, Medjed is a god that appears in the Egyptian Book of the Dead. Huh? His name apparently means the Smitter. It means nobody's actually sure that Medjed is a real name. On top of that, almost everything else about him is unknown. We don't even know if it's a... Well, I know if it's a him or hell. But I'm not going to mention that. Uh, even his form is unattainable. An unseen god that flies from the sky and shoots from his eyes. He's truly an elusive being, too. Everything about this is existed is shrouded in mystery. Wait. Fundamentally speaking, ancient Egyptians are always this. However, <laughs> Medjid's facing straight ahead in all of this dispectations, dispictions of him. Taking all of this into account, he seems to be quite the alien being. Well done, my man. Good, good research. Hey, there's nothing to be impressed about. I hope that information was at least somewhat useful. Indeed, it was. Should I look into it more? That's enough. Thank you. So we still don't have any tangible clues. Hey, uh, hey, Makoto. Well, Makoto's a nice person. She couldn't say anything like Ryuji or On would say. Okay. Uh, what is this? Uh, oh. Oh, a catchy son. Okay. Now here's the thing. The catch. Oh, we level up with Mishima and Chiaya. And then there's Akechi. You know, here's the thing. Akechi, apparently, Akechi's a time-limited confident. So I want to ra rank him up more than the others. Uh, so this is what I'm going to do. Apparently, we have to get him to rank 5 before a certain date. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, so Darts and Village, let's go and check him out. Let's go and check him out. Yes, akechi son. Hi. Hey, Senpai, good evening. Hey. Do you have some time before the shoot? If you're not busy, do you want to hang out? I feel like I can come closer. Principality. Okay. What do you want to do? Yeah, hang out. Thank good. you. That's it. Then let's get going. Alright. Enjoy it. Well, Kenkechi looks to be enjoying himself. This discussion seems to be engaging him. Yep, there you go. I'll see you later. Alright, cool. That, that helps, that helps, because he's a time-limited uh, confident, and we need to be careful, like, uh, we need to make sure, you know, we get him to max rank before the certain dates. I don't know when that date is, which is why I'm doing him, his um, rankings, cost me some markets as soon as possible, you know? Seems you've got your share of problems, inmate. Because apparently, if you don't get them to max rank, which is rank 5, that's what they cap to. Before a certain date, uh, they will be locked forever. You can't access them throughout the rest of the game until after a certain date, which sucks. Uh, so I don't want that. Um, to think you would relax under such circumstances. Either you're quite bold or quite foolish. I mean, I've 
I've had people call me both, <laughs> so... One with an unseen form. Hmm. It seems you've been targeted by troublesome company. Seems so. Have you made med jet? <laughs> I've been enjoying this endless dispute over justice. However, it will soon come to an end, and through the appearance of an unexpected force of all things. Engaging with formidable enemies is also part of your rehabilitation. I ask that you overcome this. After all, you must hone your powers and become a magnificent thief. Alright, cool. And that was okay. Nice talk with Eagle right there. Um, please, just post justice, okay? It's really summer now. I get sweaty just walking a little bit. That's what happens when it's sunny outside, bro. <laughs> I didn't think Majed would pounce on the Phantom Thieves. Interesting things keep happening this year. The influence of the Phantom Thieves <laughs> knows no bounds. Deep. <laughs> I underestimated it. Exactly, you one. you underestimated the DRP squad. Yes, my boy Akechi. <laughs> I wonder what the public thinks of this. Are they entertained? Or perhaps inconvenienced? Probably entertained. I've seen people just more entertained, if anything. Entertained, huh? They are. A luxury okay. for the uninvolved. I know they mean no ill intent. So this is what the public thinks. Oops. I don't have time for a conversation. My attendance has been poor due to interviews lately. Well, I'm pretty sure they'll let a blind eye. Since it's you, the catchy. Thank you for your valuable opinion. I'll see you around. Okay, cool. Uh, so what is it today? What do we I don't have get in it. Today? This hasn't been, there hasn't been any news of the Phantom Thieves versus Medjet showdown. Oh uh, look, look, I told you, they're so involved with it. Uh, which of them will come out on top? They're both just criminals pretend to be heroes. If you ask me, Medjet causes way more trouble. They attack every company that set that size on. I see. Well, I just hope something happens soon, but you gotta tell me, who do you think will win? find out, wouldn't we? <laughs> okay. Hey, your phone was buzzing earlier. Oh, it was? I've gotten a lot of messages from an unknown account. Aha, nice to meet you. I'm the one they call Alibaba. <laughs> Alibaba. <laughs> I want to ask you something. You are a fandom thief, aren't you? Uh, why am I making that voice? Can he really steal hearts? Who is this? Why does he know that you're a phantom thief? Is one of our teammates pulling a prank on you? <laughs> nah. There's something whose heart I would like you to steal. But I'm not asking for Chai. Let's make a deal. You wish to know about Medjet, right? I can give you information on them if the change of heart is successful. If you so desire, I can take care of them as well. Oh, oh, oh. Do you believe in my skills? I can track down accounts just as I have yours with yours. But this is all I can prove at the moment. I have prepared the necessary tools of my end. Look forward to it. Shouldn't you respond to it? I should have respond. Who is this? I can't find the account to send a response to. All I get is an ever message. Damn, they're good. You can't reply back. Good, they're good with their tracking skills. <laughs> I don't know what this is all about, but we should probably let everyone know about this. Don't worry, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. <laughs> so we'll be fine, if anything. Um, knowledge and office. Alright. Ugh, again. Tell me who's boss. Medjed, what's happening to this country? It would be hilarious if the honor student fell off the podium. Wow. It's, is it over for the Phantom Thieves? Hacking? I have no idea what it's like, but it sounds scary. It is scary, yes. I think they were getting a little cocky. They got what was coming from. Bitch, who's that? Who's that? Who said that? Dickheads. <laughs> Alright. Uh, considering he mentioned stealing hearts, he knows, doesn't he? Seems so. Seems so. <laughs> yeah, there you go. How were we found out? He may have traced our chat lock. How careless of us. How would he have known all these details with just that? That's 
<laughs> hey, I'm not gonna say anything. You think that there is another cause? Yeah. I'm not sure why, but that's the feeling I get. Hmm. Hey, is it that easy to look at someone else's chat log? I don't know much about it myself, but it's not impossible. Not possible, I think. It's not impossible. What you kid? How's it done? Maybe they extracted our phone's data. Why is he getting an error when he tries to reply? Perhaps the receiving end doesn't, doesn't even exist. exist. So they just make That's new possible. ones every time to message. Don't ask me everything. I told you that I don't know much about it. Wait, might this be what is referred to as hacking? <laughs> then does that mean this guy's a hacker? I don't get high tech it's stuff. Hacking, yeah. What does this all mean? An unknown hacker contacted us. I see. I don't really get it. <laughs> Your cats. Is this person measured? I doubt it. Considering he says he wants to deal with them. That is, only if we take his words for face value. Mm. True. Hey, wouldn't it be great if we got this guy on our side? Wow, of course. So. But we know nothing about his identity at all. Mm. We can't trust him. I don't think it's a bad deal, though. Even if Alibaba turns out to be a criminal, I am not helping anyone of that sort. <laughs> See ya. Oh, right. That wouldn't be good. The I've prepared the necessary tool part makes no sense either. Could this just be a prank? Nah, it's far away from a prank, on Far away. He knows an awful lot for it to be a prank. Yeah. Steamy Hearts, Medjed. Uh, yeah. If he knows who we are, won't we get caught? No, if he wanted to report us, I think he would have done it already. He must have some sort of objective of his own. He did offer us a deal after all. It's funny because um, they mentioned their name as Alibaba, so they just automatically thought it's a guy! <laughs> yeah. Well, it can be a guy, but it could also be a girl as well, just pretending to be a male's name. I don't know. I'm sure well, I do know, but I don't want to tell you guys. <laughs> There's no telling when he'll do so, though. It'd be best if we stay together. If something happens, we can act at once. Makes sense. Yeah. So, somewhere we can wait and hide for long hours. Ah, uh, it's gonna be my home place, isn't it? How about LeBlanc? I knew it. Of course, there you go. LeBlanc. Alright. <laughs> oh! What's with the big group? Hey, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Good evening. We were thinking about putting together plans for our summer. Hmm. Is that a new face I see? Oh. It's nice to meet you. My name is Makoto Nijima. I hope we're not being a bother. You might recognize the name because of Sai Nijima coming to meet him and then bothering him all the time. She's our student council president. Nijima? Yep. Is something wrong? No, it's nothing. But I don't think Sojo as a type of guy will lash out against someone like the sister of Sai Nijima being recorded in this case because he, he, I'm pretty sure he must know that both of them are two different people so he's got no reason to do that. A student council president, eh? <laughs> I'm stunned. I hope he's not causing you too much trouble. Why do people... Okay. I'm Sojiro <laughs> Sakura, but everyone just calls me boss. Boss. By the way, that was addressed to you. Me? Uh, this old man will get going and leave you kids be. Hey, thanks, man. All right. The store's all yours. Oh, you won't trash the place. <laughs> we have late-breaking news on Medjit, whose notoriety rose since their statement the other day. Hmm, of course. Just moments ago, a new message has been released on their website. They have announced their victory over the Phantom Thieves. Medjit also warns any Japanese citizens who praised the Phantom Thieves to stop doing so. We will report any further actions by Medjit as they arrive. Oh, come on! It's in English! <laughs> Let me see. The Phantom Thieves remain silent at our question. This proves that we are just. Oh. Yeah. People of Japan, wake up. You must not worship the Phantom Thieves. What? That's bullshit! <laughs> Keep 
keep listening. We will discipline any who worship them. The punishment is the confiscation of possessions. Damn. We are Medjed. We are unseen. We will eliminate we evil. We will eliminate evil. Oh, okay. That's what it says. What does that all mean? They're saying that they'll target sympathizers if the Phantom That's beeps. pretty, that's pretty, that's a pretty low, that's pretty low to do, I'll be honest. Confiscation of possessions, hmm? Like, probably like, uh, personal details on the website, or on the computers, or any electronic device, probably. Perhaps bank accounts, or personal information? Personal information. Either way, it won't be anything pleasant. Yeah, definitely. Why the hell are we being singled out? Perhaps all they care about is labeling the Phantom Thieves as crooks. That all this wouldn't have happened had the Phantom Thieves not existed. That's complete bullshit! Mm. Talk about a troublesome organization that we've been targeted by. Isn't there anything we can do? It's certain we can't do anything about Damn, this. It's a bit hot own. today as well, man. Jesus. Just take my jacket off. Don't know why I even had it in the first place. Uh. Hey, so what's this letter about? I don't need any more trouble. Right. It's rare for you to get something like this. I know, I know. <laughs> Who is it from? A calling card. Oh. <laughs> wow. Anything else in there? Same. Who's okay. this from, anyway? Probably, probably from Med Medjet. There's no stamp on it. Someone must have directly dropped it into the mailbox here. Yeah. Could it have been Alibaba? Alibaba. That reminds me. He did mention something about preparing the necessary tool. Wow. Don't tell me. Is this what he was talking about? What the hell's going on here? <laughs> All we can do at the moment is wait for Alibaba's orders. Let's brace that? ourselves and stand by. In case anything comes up. Oh dear. Yep, this sucks. <laughs> I know, it sucks. Oh. I've really started turning the heat off on the forum. I've got a special post up and everything. The showdown between the Phantom Thieves and Global Organization Medjet's hair. Oh my goodness, you know. Great reactions have been great too. Everyone's really engaged. So far, most of the comments have been pro Phantom Thieves. Mostly, like, mo most likely because of what happened in the Connor Shield case. Those on the other side say Medjet are hacks of justice, but there's nothing resembling justice in what they do. Someday I'll want the whole site to be filled with pro, pro thieves comment. I'm looking forward to when that day finally arrives. He can look forward to whatever <laughs> he wants. We have no means of striking back against Medjet. Mm. We're gonna be in deep trouble if we don't do something. No, no, no reason to strike Medjet, mm. but... It's gonna get to the point where we're gonna get overwhelmed if we don't. First, the Alibaba character and now black calling card. What the hell is going on? Alright. Uh. So, can I make some. I can make information okay. calls. Uh, but I can't go outside, most likely. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yes. Make more, more lockpicks. I don't care. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> wow, what an efficient use of materials. You ended up with more than I expected. Oh damn, we got six! Same! Yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we ranked up! We actually ran We ranked up with Master Full! <laughs> yes! Right. Master Full nice. proficiency. I saw that the way you use your hands. You did great. I get that a lot, guys. That's what she said. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. Um, but yeah, nah. We ranked up on proficiency quite well. Well then. Okay, let's get to bed. Alright. So, that's pretty good. Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, looks like we decreased a bit in the percentage. Uh, what cheap ass justice? Shit plus shit equals shit sandwich. <laughs> oh, okay, that's pretty funny. Um, why haven't the Vendor Thieves said anything? Having your money stolen sounds terrifying. It's uncertainly not knowing what they're going to do to us. They're declaring their victory. What does that mean? I really wish they'd stop that. Yes. <laughs> shit plus shit. Equals shit sandwich. <laughs> Good Casa morning. Me. Casa me. <sighs> Every day is so hot. I empty my water bottle so fast. By the way, summer break is coming up. Could I ask what your plans are? Uh, 
I mean, I'm nothing at the moment. What about you? So, anyway... I'll be mostly doing training with our gymnastics team, if I, and if I have free time, I'll be doing self-training. Oh, would you like to join? Hey, I would love to join you anytime. Yo, whenever you're available, we'll be fine. All the train set, let's get going then. I'll be able to train with you anytime, yo. Anytime. <laughs> Message. Uh, it's just Ryuji. <laughs> Nothing. No, there's no any stop if he tries to get in touch with you, okay? Cool. Ryuji again? He just never shuts up, does he? No, it's Alibaba. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> there you go. Good day. Good day to you too. Are you a spender today? Once again, I'm, um, I'm Alibaba. You're the leader of the Phantom Thieves, correct? That's right. Hmm, I appreciate your honesty. I take it you received the calling card? So it really was from this guy. Are you at school right now? I'm in class. You're a surprisingly diligent student. Now then, I've prepared the calling card for you. When are you going to steal it? Steal from who? What do you mean by that? Aren't you able to steal a heart as long as you have a calling card? Tell him. You need a name. We need a name, you idiot. We need the name of the target. What an idiot. <laughs> What's the target's name? A name is your heart through the very truly impossible without such information. It is. <laughs> I see. Hmm, I suppose post calling cards did have names on them. One moment. Very well, I will tell you. I believe their name was Futaba Sakura. Remember this name, guys. Remember this name, alright? For people that are watching this for the first time, remember this name. If you fail in this mission, I'll expose your identity to the world and to the police. Well then, I'll be counting on you. We shall speak again after the change of heart. Who's Futaba Sakura? Can't find the account to send a response to. All I get is a back. So he threatened you, then just took off? Sakura? I feel like I've heard that name before. Sojo Sakura. <laughs> In any case, we should let everyone know about this. Remember. Hey. We're gonna get reported if we don't do this? What the hell? Wait, how long did, we, did he give us to complete this game? I can't Taba remember. Taba Sakura? Wasn't Sakura... It's boss's last name! Yeah. Sojo Sakura. Does he have any family? Does he? For reals? How way back are you? Well, well, he... I only see him at the cafe, not anyone else. Wouldn't you normally be introduced at least? I mean, you are living at his place. No, I'm living at the... I'm living at the long cafe shop, not at his house. Well, his situation does make things difficult calling card was delivered to boss's house it'd be more natural to assume this is all related mm. one of the reasons for that is because alibaba mentioned nothing about which futaba sakura perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough that makes sense i believe it's adequate for us to think that this is the doing of someone close by yeah it is it is i see i don't know how alibaba got a hold of his smartphone information However, since he's ordering us through chat, I do feel as though he's taunting us. <laughs> you okay. mean this might just be a prank? Ugh, I, 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 nah, nah. Just... I mean, look at his demands. Pay me if you don't want me to leak who you really are. That I'd understand. But he's telling us to steal someone's heart without explaining why. So we're being tested. Regardless. I think we should ask boss about Futaba Sakura once. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know if we're gonna get a good response from That's probably for the best. <laughs> There's nothing else we can do at the moment, and Chief might have an idea on what this is about too. I'll check the school's roster just in case. Cool. You must make sure boss doesn't figure out who we are. Oh, yeah. We'll have to go about this yeah, cautiously. Yeah, you can't find out we have the phantom base, otherwise... <laughs> <laughs> our probation goodbye. <laughs> goodbye to our probation. In a bad way. Hmm? What's up? Why 
Why do you know about that? Oh, <laughs> you see? Look at that, look at that sort of response. Uh-oh. It's got nothing to do with you. Oh. I'm going home. Make sure you lock up the place. Ooh, look at that response. Yeah, I like that response there. Looks like it's a hit. Yep. It's a hit, my boys. <laughs> I expected the sort of response though. Oh, I just remembered. Dino, were you able to ask the boss about Kotaba Sakura? He didn't want to talk. Could there be a reason as to why that was? Hmm, Alibaba might be our only hope of defeating Menjin. I wish we could get some info out about Kutaba out of us. But trying to force it would probably have the opposite effect, exactly. To be honest, I owe a great deal to both Boss and Nina. I don't wish for this to be a source of discord between them. Yeah, I know just what you mean. It's probably best to wait for Boss to bring the subject up himself. Yeah, it's probably, probably the best way to go about it. Okay. Uh, tell me, tell me I can go outside, please, please. Hey! Damn it! Damn it! Okay. I mean, I can study. I can try study. I can try study. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Brew coffee. I could brew coffee. I can study. Oh! Mm. What do you want to do? You know what? Oh! What do you want to do? Yeah, let's study. Why not? Why not? I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. <laughs> Can I talk? The other day I saw on TV. Oh, didn't mean to distract you. I tried to stay quiet. <laughs> You're making some good progress. I can see the whistle in your eyes behind those glasses. <laughs> Alright. I mean, might as well have used this time to actually get some points up, right? Well then. Tell yourself that if you keep at it for too long, you should stop for today and get some sleep. Alright. Staying out of the shit. <laughs> Internet showdown. <laughs> Yo. Tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but we still got all this lame shit coming up. If you don't take care of this lame shit, you can kiss your summer vacation goodbye. Oh, yeah. About this Futaba Sakura girl. If she's related to Boss, think people living nearby would know about her? That's some keen intuition coming from you, Ryuji. You should have made use of that on your exam. <laughs> Come on, Morgana. You can't you can't compliment him and then diss him at the same time. Do one. Uh, I never want to think about exams ever again. But you made a good point. That's awesome. Anyway, asking around in your neighborhood might be the fastest way to figure this shit out. And again, I doubt it'll be that easy. It never is. That's life, my man. That is life. Such is life. I hate it when Ryuji is always crouched out like this as well. He's a pretty tall guy. He's a pretty tall guy. <laughs> He's just crouched like this all the time. Some vacation. Some vacation starts the day after tomorrow, but don't forget, there's an urgent assembly on Monday. We'll be taking attendance. There's an unusual number of strange incidents this year. Don't do anything stupid over break. Got it? Don't go someplace shady like the red light district and go and don't go to the beach after dark. I wanna go to the beach, I wanna jump into the water. <sighs> Seems like we won't be having fun on our summer break for a while. Alright. Lunch time after school. Okay, let's go. Luigi might be right, we don't have a single clue, miles or try, we've got nothing to lose. Let's head to Yongen and gather in for around their neighborhood. Alright, guess that's what we are doing right now. Uh, let's see. You? Utaba? Utaba, yes, I know I, that name. I heard it somewhere before. Ah, yes, that was the name of the teacher. I had, a, I had a crush on back when I was in elementary school. As well as some other people, too. Dude, that's not what I wanted to ask one for. Shocker. Utaba? Who knows? By the way, D is not. Hey, I'm a growing boy. If it's just you and him, you can eat Dean up or two, right? You must have quite the appetite. Wait, what? You're telling me you don't actually eat that much? Maybe it's the boss who eats a lot, but that's us some other people then. Butaba, who's that? I don't think I know anybody by that name. Oh, wouldn't this Butaba get angry if they find out that you're sleeping on them though? Okay. Okay, so, I'll fast them, I'll fast them, and so it's this. No, no, I don't know who that could be. Alright, <clears throat> uh, let's see, I've been there, I've been there, so I'll sit there, 
Sakwa's son single, right? I thought he didn't have any children. The fan of these are dangerous to society. Send us your opinions by email facts. Who is this rubbish about fandom things? They're not real. There's always there's no way people like that are real. Uh, that's not the sort of <coughs> thing I was wanting. Oh cool. <coughs> Our biggest lead seems to be, the chief buys a lot of food. Far more than enough for one person living alone. Yep. Let's check out all the shops where you can buy food. Okay, cool. So, all the food stores. Alright, here we go. <laughs> this place is close to LeBlanc, so we might be able to learn something here. Cool. Hmm, Futaba? Over at Sakura-san's? There you go. I haven't heard anything. Oh, sorry. Okay. There you Come go. Again. Okay. Damn it. I thought we had a hit, but... We didn't find anything on Futaba. I think our only option now is to go home and ask the chief directly. Well, I mean, we knew how that went the last time. Oh. <sighs> <clears throat> you read the letter, did you not? So you're the one who tipped him off about Futaba. You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you about Wakaba. Tipped off. What are you talking about? Back to the matter at hand. No, she didn't, so. Your parental authority will have to be suspended. I take it you're okay with that outcome? Same. What? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points in your favor. Same. Would you like to take this to domestic court? Our chances of victory are roughly 99.9% .9 though. <laughs> with these suspicions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. You're going that far? I told you I don't know a damn thing about it! We're extremely serious about this. And he seems very serious as well, Gil. As long as there's a possibility that cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns. I... Fine. You win. Thank you. I will contact you at a later date. That smile pisses me off sometimes as well. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. That's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will just be for a nice cup of coffee. Oh yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure. And stay out! That woman is real good at pissing people off. Oh, bro, I know, I know how you feel, my man. I know how you feel when it comes to signing as you are. I feel the same way. What's with that look? You got something to say? What was that? <laughs> this doesn't involve you. I mean, I know that much. This will talk about your daughter? <laughs> this is not gonna go well. Uh, that's enough. Yeah. Just behave yourself. Keep going to school if you don't want me to throw you out of here. You got that? <laughs> Lock the door up. Well, that basically confirms Futaba exists, at least. But it sounds like she's got her own problems. Yeah. Oops. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. Mm. Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive something? Yeah, cognitive science. I wonder what the chief's hiding. We can't really press him on the subject, though. Especially after he mentioned throwing you out. There's nothing much we can do at this point. Two <laughs> sets. Okay. <clears throat> Yo, how'd it go? Did you find out anything about Futaba Sakura? I've been wondering about that too. At the hideout, okay? Well, who? So you did learn something. Fine work. I knew we could count on you. Dino can. Thank you. Alright, let's all meet up tomorrow. Alright. Oh, come on, really? Uh, okay, let's let's bump up the knowledge a bit more. Oh, 
what do you want to do? You know what? What happens if I try to brew coffee? Hey! Let me try to brew some coffee. It says. Oh. I love the smell of good coffee. Yes! I mean, All you right. always say yes. The way you're drinking it makes it look delicious. Alright. Let's say the chief gentleman in charm is rubbing on me. Oh, charm. Oh, we, we bump up in charm as well. Okay, that's good. That's good. I did not know that. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Okay, so the next day. Uh, damn. How long was this arc? This whole um, Medjed arc? I can't remember. It wasn't that long from what I remembered, I'll be honest. A woman was threatening boss? Yeah. She was going on about domestic abuse and taking the case to court and stuff. Uh, yeah, I think I think Makoda has a idea of who that was. <laughs> What's up? It's nothing. Yeah, she's just, she's gonna keep it to herself for now. So to summarize what you told us, Futaba is boss's daughter, and he's abusing her. Nah, nah. That's the thing. They're they're just chatting a bunch of bull. He's not. I don't know him very well. Is he really the kind of person nah. who would do that? Nah, it was it was a bunch of bullshit. What she was saying, you know, with the whole abusive stuff. There's no way. There's no way. I would like to believe so as well, but. We don't have any conclusive evidence, do we? Yeah, but I've known enough, enough to know that that is full of bullshit. Is it only Baba? Indeed it is. I've, I've given you a calling card and told you a target name. You should be ready for this. Why aren't you doing it? I told you I'd help you if you stole a heart. What seems to be the hold up? I also said I'll report your identity to a police if you didn't help me. Are you okay with that? I'm serious, sir. What a selfish person. <laughs> well, he does have information on us. Anyways, this Futaba he's talking about have a palace? If so, I need keywords, keywords to get to in. Go in. Try messaging him about it. Does she have a palace? Palace? What are you talking about palaces for? That has nothing to do with this conversation. Are you just saying random stuff to dodge the issue? What are we supposed to do about I this? Mean, they don't know the whole one. Find the thieves. Uh, We'd be able to figure out right. Alibaba's identity if we could just meet with him. Try asking him if there's any way we could meet up. Let's meet someone. Meet with me. That will be difficult. I have reasons for not going, not being able to go out. That's why I'm contacting you. Like you this. can't go out. <clears throat> Wait, I get it. You steal people's heart directly. That might make things a bit difficult. Extremely difficult. One moment. I'm thinking. Okay, it's a shame, but I'm calling this deal off. Stop looking into Futaba, Sakura. Forget this ever happened, I won't report you to a police either. Don't worry. Sakura taking your time now, if you will excuse me. Psh, I said the deal's off! We're never going to speak again. Don't expect me to contact you anymore either. We're not done here. It's this Dame. Huh? Did he just shut the whole operation down? <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. This doesn't make any sense. This was weird. This was a whole Not only can Alibaba not go out, but he won't let us meet Futaba either. Well, it's none of our business now. We can't contact him anymore. But what do we do about Medjed? We won't be able to get Alibaba to help us with them now. Maybe they were just pranking us. They made that huge declaration, but they ain't done nothing since. <laughs> I bet we got him freaked out. You mean they backed out because they're afraid we'll change their hearts? I mean, we didn't even have anything to change their hearts with to, be, yep. to begin with. And now it'd just make them look lame if they came out and apologized. But... I guess with Alibaba and Medjid out of the picture, can we just say this case is closed? You do have a point. I guess it is safe for us to relax a little. Oh yeah! Remember Kaneshiro's treasure? Prepare to have your minds blown! We got... 150,000 yen out of it. That's a lot. Jane, that's a lot. That's awesome. We can really go all out with that kind of money. <laughs> yeah. Let's make up for what happened at the fireworks festival. Jane, that's a lot. <laughs> we gotta go eat something fitting for the Phantom Thieves worldwide debut. Oh, this is the ramen place and he says some stupid... Uh, would... like... Ooh, how about sushi? Sushi. Could really go for some eel too. The best method is to fill yourself on ginger before beginning to eat sushi. That is my master technique. <laughs> you don't need to do that this time. Actually, definitely don't do it. Okay? What is the press ginger? He gives off a weird smell. Or is it garlic? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm all for sushi. You're okay with that too, right? Sushi's fine. 
this. Then it's decided. All right, we'll go tomorrow night. Oh, I mean, we've got to go to school on Monday, being the 25th, but after that, it's summer holiday, so. I wonder if that, if all that medjet business was just a plan. Now that I think about it, can't strange today, I haven't actually done anything since anything yet. If their goal was to target the Phantom Thieves, they should want to be acting now, giving out fame. Huh. When you put it that way, it kind of makes me wonder too. Especially after they taunted us technically. Theoretically. Theo theoretic oh yeah, I can't even say that shit properly. Yes, however, it would be best for us to come up with a countermeasure regardless. For now though, we should cautiously eat, enjoy the sushi, that's all we can do. Something's not right. I was thinking that too, I can't really put it into words though. Use case right. I'm sorry for bringing this up on the day before our celebration party too. Ciao, Moko, we'll be eating sushi like kings tomorrow. Oh, one person is in particular on their best behavior. I will refrain from saying who though. You better not be, <laughs> you better not be talking about me. <laughs> hey man, leave Luigi alone. He's poor. He's poor man. Leave the boy alone. <laughs> Okay, let's let's do some studying. One power knowledge up. Oh, Thanks. what do you want to do? Might as well, you know. Why not? Why the heck not? Can I talk? Can I talk? No, you cannot talk. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are we? Oh, no, I was gonna say. I thought I thought we well, got, we got um, <laughs> knowledge to rank four. Okay. Um, so what's next? 24th, which is the Sunday. Oh. You seem quite busy, sai -san. I take it you're stuck in the middle of everything? The Phantom Thieves made a mockery of us when they brought down Kanashiro. Well, it's not our fault your police department could not do shit to Kanashiro. They don't, we didn't make a mockery, we just did something you guys couldn't pull off. Well, in a way, that is called mockery. Was they couldn't do it, and we did <laughs> straight up. So, and to make matters worse, Medjid, who has been dormant for some time now, just declared war on them. How much more can they screw us over? Stress is bad for the skin, you know. <laughs> did you come all this way simply to be sarcastic? How about you listen to my deductions for a change of pace? You may think it absurd. But, don't you think the case you are pursuing and the actions of the Phantom Thieves overlap somehow? What are you basing this off of? The one point of commonality across all cases is how those involved have an unforeseen change of heart. Okay. I've suspected that myself, but those suspicions are unfounded. I told you at the beginning that this was only a deduction. <laughs> These just Phantom Thieves are riling up the public. However, that is a disguise. Their true goal is terrorist action by way of psychotic breakdowns. Time. Is that too much? There's nothing at the moment that falsifies that claim. Have you mentioned this to the police? I'd never tell them such things. The only value they have to me is in their mobility and organizational capabilities. Hmm. Hmm. It seems having you lend me a hand has paid off. Hmm. I'm glad to hear that. I hate all of these people. <laughs> for different reasons, for different reasons, of course. Did you learn anything from the guardian of that mental shutdown victim's daughter? Nothing at all. I see. Now, what should my next action be for our victory? Handle the Phantom Thieves without remorse. Oh. Use any means necessary to win. That's how I would deal with them. Oh, without any remorse? <laughs> Very well. This seems to be fun for you. Are you on to something? No, not at all. Well then, <laughs> to our victory. Dang. Without remorse, alright. Alright, she doesn't want remorse, hey? Okay. Time for sushi! The place is in Ginza, right? Do we do we take the usual drink from Shibuya? Ginza! Okay. Aside from the shop's cafe, I have plenty. If you're tired from shopping, get tea. Alright. You can also invite people who may enjoy expensive eating expensive sushi to hang out with me there. I'm pretty sure Cosme likes eating a lot, so. But she eats quite a bit. She has a big appetite, so I don't know. She might enjoy sushi. But then again, she'll probably be about talking about the calories and 
yada yada, so I don't know. Man, the flounder is out of this world. <laughs> that texture. Uh, I don't see any prices listed here. <laughs> it's called market price. Don't worry about it, we got the cash. So good. <laughs> Tuna ready yet? Your horses. Yeah, don't talk! <laughs> By the way. Yep. Is Boss really the kind of person nah, who would abuse someone? No way. Someone? No way. That again? I can't get it off my mind. Especially if it means he could be taken to court. No way. What no kind way. of person is he? Do you truly believe he'd do such a thing? No way. No chance. No chance. Hmm. If it's really true about the abuse, he'd be a no good jerk pretending to be a guardian. But it's not. Maybe the chief is the one who needs a change of heart. <laughs> Hold on a sec. About that, I actually got curious after our conversation and checked his name in the nav. Sounds to me like there wasn't a hit. Okay. Right. Anything beyond this is his family's problem. We probably shouldn't get any more involved. Hmm. Wait, you think Alibaba could be Boss's ex-wife? <laughs> he must have cheated on her, and that's where Futaba came from. Oh my god. Wow. Doubtful. I mean, it's definitely a unique, uh, <laughs> unique assumption from you, but like, on sense doubtful. Your imagination has run rampant. <laughs> How foolish. How foolish. Still, this is delicious. I've never experienced anything quite like it before. Man, and it's all thanks to us being the fan of these. <laughs> this is. I remember this. I remember when this happened in the original Persona 5 game. I kind of face palmed myself instantly. I was like, Ryuji, you idiots! Crap! Uh, um, the fan fantastic! Sushi is delicious! Oh my god! <laughs> yeah! The fish is so fresh! Mm. Everywhere we go, we hear about these phantom thieves! What rubbish! Uh, just... Think about where we are, Ryuji! <laughs> Sorry, you just kind of slipped! <laughs> my apologies for bringing up Boss again. We should just enjoy oh the food! <laughs> Everyone just looked at Ryuji and you was like... Shit. <laughs> oh, that, oh, that's probably one of the best parts. In, one of the best parts in this game. Ijima san, what are you doing here? Akechi kun. Akechi? You're the ones from the TV station. Could it be that you're friends of Nijima san? Indeed, we are. Do you know this guy? It's nice to meet you. My name is Akechi. Glad to make your acquaintance, Yusuke Kitagawa. How do you know my name? <laughs> he was like, no need. <laughs> well, because I'm a psychic, of course. <laughs> I'm only joking. Wow. In truth, I'm a rookie detective. You're a former pupil of Madarame, right? I have actually just recently joined the investigation team looking. Did you see that Majed has Shit. declared war on them? Sorry, I clicked it by accident. <laughs> war? Their website was updated just a moment ago. For real? Ah, uh, English again. <laughs> English. Oh, wait, what? What's it say? Huh. Why do you seem so agitated? Oh, um... She's, uh, a huge fan of the Phantom Thieves. Yeah, a total nut job for him. <laughs> hmm. I don't know how wise it is to be a fan of groups like them. What is with these comments? My apologies. I didn't mean to butt into your conversation. I must say, this is an interesting group. I know. People say we are an interesting group because of the unique people in this um, group. The prosecutor Nijima's sister, an ex-pupil of Madarame, and a few Shujin Academy students. It seems you're all connected to the Phantom Thieves. Perhaps you have better intel than I do. Ah, yes. I wanted to ask you something. <laughs> What's... Regarding this whole Mejed commotion, 
If you were one of the Phantom Thieves, what would you do? Mm. I mean... Ugh. I'll probably ignore them until they actually make a move. Because well, since, you know, since the declaration of war, they haven't done anything. So, I probably won't retaliate. Just to be honest with you, I'll ignore them. That is unexpected. Only a small minority of people believe that is the best decision. Sorry to disappoint, but we're just normal high school kids. If anything, we want to hear what you got to say, Mr. Detective. <laughs> My profiling of the Phantom Thieves has led me to believe they are a group of juveniles. juveniles. They have a relative amount of free time after school and a hideout to slip away to. Wow. Furthermore, considering Kamashita was their first target, it seems they began activity around April. Jeez, you know, as much as I hate Akechi, his detective skills are to be reckoned with. <laughs> In a way, all I've just said about the Phantom Thieves coincides with the group you have here. Uh, you see, his detective skills are, are pretty scary, so... What? You gonna report us? I didn't say I was being suspicious of you. Fuji is about the thief. He seemed to be a suspicious one. I wasn't anticipating that response. You always find a way to rise above my expectations. You really are an intriguing one. Get that a lot. <laughs> I lack your calm mannerisms, but don't you think my deduction is an interesting one? Definitely is interesting, was actually right. <laughs> How about we make a great team if we work together? <laughs> what the hell are you saying? Well, this has been a valuable point of reference for me. I hope to see you all again. Dang. He's on to us. He's on to us. <laughs> a man's on to us. What was that about? You think he's ascertained our true identities? He's on to us. Nah, couldn't be. Right? I'd like to say that it's simply us overthinking this, but maybe best to be cautious from now on. Oh, yeah. We shouldn't forget that Alibaba was able to discover who we are. True. True. But it's not as though we had tangible evidence to prove that discovery. Just keep acting normally. More importantly, things are getting serious with Medjet. Oh yeah! What did they write? Here, I'll read it. We are disappointed in the people of Japan and their belief in the Phantom Thieves' false justice. Hence, we shall proceed with our plan to cleanse Japan. This process will commence on August 21st. August 21st? I mean, we've got almost a month for that. <laughs> As a result, the Japanese economy shall suffer devastating damages. For real? Keep going. However, we are magnanimous. We will give the Phantom Thieves one final opportunity to repent. As proof of this repentance, we demand that they reveal their identities <laughs> to the public. Dang. We will attack if these demands remain unmet. The future of Japan rests with the Phantom Thieves. Wow. <laughs> we are Medjed. We are, are unseen. unseen. We will eliminate Dang. evil. That's what it says. Jesus. Um, sounds bad. Okay, August 21st, that's actually quite a bit of time. In other words, if we don't unmask ourselves, Medjet will attack Japan, correct? But here's the thing. I, in this game at least, I've been trying to finish the palaces within two to three days max. So, I would say 1 to 21st of August is a lot of time for me. It seems they're quite the attention seekers. What are we going to do about this? I mean, we've got no other choice now. If only we could get in contact with Alibaba. Our only clues? Our boss and Futaba. Anyways, it's too damn hot out here. Why don't we go to Leblanc? We can talk more over there. Cool. Okay. We went through all sorts of options on our way here, but looks like we got no choice but to ask for Alibaba's help. Question is, how do we get in touch with him? What is that? He cut off all contact with us after that misunderstanding. Then again. If we manage to steal Futaba's heart, he may attempt to reach out to us once more. But we don't have any clues on what her keywords are. Damn it, Alibaba! Where the hell are you? <laughs> Actually, he may be closer than we think. Huh? 
Hypothetically speaking, even if we stole Futaba's heart... Oh, here comes Okoto's brains kicking in. How would Alibaba know that the deed has been done? Would he truly be able to discern that just from cell phone messages? You mean he'd have to meet her in person? Alibaba was able to deliver the calling card here. Mm. On top of that, he can check on Futaba's condition. However, according to the circumstances he put forth, he's unable to meet with us. I know what she's gonna say. I think I know what she's gonna say. This leads me to believe that it would be bad for him if we were to see the two of them together. It seems to me Alibaba may in fact be Futaba herself. There you go. Hey, Makoto, Makoto, you are a genius. <laughs> for real? Okay. So she's asking that we steal her own heart? Maybe she wants us to save her from the scars of her abuse. I'd like to meet with Boss. He lives nearby, right? I know where his house is. I agree. It's real late, though. What are we gonna tell Boss when we get there? We'll say this takeout sushi is a gift for him. But my fatty tuna! <laughs> no complaining. Let's all go together. Yeah, calm down. Boss, Damn maybe it. gets the wrong idea if he and I show up alone. Fair enough. Bro, oh, this is when we get to see Futaba for the first time. Nobody's answering. Uh, but yeah. Uh, turns out that Alibaba is actually Futaba herself. Uh, and that, and the person sought that we're gonna steal is Futaba. Futaba software in this case. But the lights are on. Think she's napping? Even Boss would have woken up with how many times we've rung this doorbell. <laughs> I would think Futaba would have answered by now if she were here too. Oh, the gate is unlocked. Dude, you can't go opening other people's stuff like that. <laughs> but, but look, the door seems to be slightly open as well. I wonder why. That's rather careless. It sounds like it's going to rain. We should get inside. <laughs> All right. Do you think that's okay? I don't know. Probably. Probably. <laughs> My <laughs> apologies, boss. <laughs> My apologies, boss. I love, I love McCullough, man. So cute. Hello? Alright. He's not out, is he? The door ahead is open, and I can hear the TV. I hope he didn't pass out or something. I mean, boss is kind of old, ain't he? <laughs> I'm a bit worried. Oh, Should we go in and check on him? Please excuse us. Right. <laughs> Scream? What was that? How should I know? <laughs> out for uh, I'm not freaking out could it be Alibaba I mean Futaba maybe maybe not I don't know it's gonna uh, be bad sorry um can I hold your hand <laughs> oh god <laughs> oh, is he, it just, <laughs> she's just so damn cute sometimes obviously I'm going towards the romantic route of um Kasumi, but I can't help but just say how cute Makoto is. <laughs> I can sense someone's presence. <laughs> Who's okay. Who is it? I can sense someone's presence. Who's there? I can't take this anymore. I'm leaving. No. No. My legs won't move. <laughs> Right there, if you didn't. You're a hacker, right? Just show yourself! I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, please save me, sis! <laughs> Are you okay, Futaba? Oh no. Crap, he's home! <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Who the hell are you? Don't move! 
Oh my god, it just looks so... If she was to shift a bit to the right hand side, it would look so wrong right now. <laughs> you hear me? What is he trying to... Oh, it's a flashlight, bro. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, sis. Somebody please save me. <laughs> this is jokes. You? What are you doing in my house? <laughs> you are... Oh, uh, good... Good evening, sir. We... We didn't mean to intrude. Joker's just there like, hey, hey, I got nothing to do to his sis, yo. She's holding my leg. <laughs> I can't go. Nijima san. Wait, are you two dating? I... We're just friends. Yeah, that's true. In, unfortunately, in this game, they we are. Friends nowadays get that close to each other? <laughs> <laughs> but that's not it. This... Yeah, um, hey. Uh, things uh, happened... And she doesn't. Um. You kids are here too. Um, we brought you some sushi, but nobody answered when we rang the bell. The door was unlocked too. We could hear the TV though, so we got worried he might have passed out or something. The door was unlocked. Yes. <laughs> uh, I do that sometimes because I'm getting old. <laughs> oh. Um, excuse me. There's something we'd like to ask. Cool. Huh? You want to ask me? There's someone else living here. Isn't there? Yes. Yeah. My daughter. Could she be Futaba Sakura? You told Nijima-san too? Hey, don't look at me, bro! Hey, don't look at me! Hey, this has nothing to do with me. Uh, um... <laughs> Is there any way we could meet with Futaba-san? I think we may have frightened her earlier, so we'd like to apologize if at all possible. Well, uh, that's... Is she sick? No, no, it's not like that. <sighs> oh boy. I want you all getting the wrong idea. I shouldn't have kept this a secret from you. Hey, everyone, eat. every one of us have secrets, my man, so it's all good, so good. Let's talk at my shop. She'll hear us if we stay here. Makes sense. Cool. You know what? I'll be right back, guys. Uh, no. Where do I start? I'll be right back. I'm going to use the toilet real quick, but I'll be right back. And this is recording has been going for so long, so... Uh, I will stop it soon, but before that, I need to probably finish this conversation and then end the video, but I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back right now, guys, so back to the topic at hand. <laughs> so let's get to this. Futaba's mother and I knew each other long before Futaba was born. Her mother was a bit of a weird one, but we got along well for some reason. It happens, bro. It happens. She was sharp-witted, somewhat stern, a little socially inept, but always carefree. She truly was a great woman. Well, we see. <laughs> when something piqued her interest, that'd be all she focused on. She always worked deep into the night. I thought that had changed after her kid was born. But having Futaba didn't do much. Even with that, she always took good care of her. Working and watching over a child at the same time sounds it's rough. rough. It is rough. I can imagine, because I've seen it first time. They do you have a hard time, they do. I guess raising Futaba alone turned out to be tough on her in more ways than one. What about a father? There wasn't a father. Do you mean... Well, there probably was one. I didn't know him, though. Mm. She never said a word about him, either. She was single when she gave birth to Futaba, and single when she raised her. Cool. They were an ordinary, loving family. You could really tell how much she cared for Futaba. <sighs> but one day she left, leaving Futaba behind. Yes, she committed suicide. Suicide? Threw herself into the street. Right in front of Futaba. Yeah, that's the worst thing in front of Futaba as well, of all things. Like that that does a lot to a kid. I mean 
Fudaba must have been a child as well when she saw that with her own eyes. That must do a lot. Fuck up completely. Shocking doesn't begin to describe that. It, it, exactly. That's just it's putting a light. Devastating for a kid. Yeah. So. Well, a lot happened after that, but I ended up taking custody of Futaba. Cool. At first, she was so depressed, she she wouldn't even talk to me. Oh, of course that makes sense. She saw her mother die. Was that because she couldn't get over her mother's suicide? I kept talking to her, though, and she started opening up to me, little by little. That's good. That's when I found out Futaba blames herself for her mother's death. What? But why? That part, she's never told me. Oh. I wanted to know what led her to believing that. But I decided not to rub salt in the wound. Okay, that makes sense. Then, makes sense. a few months ago, she started getting real scared. Even when nothing was happening, she'd say things like, I hear voices and mom is looking at me. And distorted the size, probably. Visual and auditory hallucinations. I mean, Have you taken that Futaba well. to a doctor? I wanted to, but she refused. Even when I had a doctor come, she locked herself away in the room. I feel like once we change our heart, Futaba's heart, I think those stuff will, will go away eventually. Since then, she's become what you'd call a shut -in. shut in. She won't take a single step outside the house. Or even try to see other people. Mm. What about you? She doesn't even let me come in her room. Dang. That's pretty harsh. <laughs> Utaba is, well, a unique girl. She's so quick minded that conversations with her tend to jump from one topic to the next. <laughs> Hard to keep up then. <laughs> it seems like she's always coming to conclusions in her head. There's a lot I don't get about her. Dang. So, yeah, her situation is why I couldn't let you in my house. That's all good, bro. It's all good. I understand, my man. I understand. What Futaba needs is a safe place where nobody will threaten her. Somewhere she can be at ease. That's why I won't do anything she doesn't want. I don't make her do anything she's unwilling to, either. That's good. That's good to know, bro. And again, I know that's no way for her to live. I mean, obviously... You know, this is a very long process. Uh, she's got to open bit by bit, right? So... It's all I can do, though. Hmm. What does Rudolph want? I don't know. She just asks me for things that she wants. Like food, or... These complicated books. Hmm. Well... That's that. So, can you just... Leave her be? Of course. No, man. Of course. I'm gonna head back, then. You all had better head home soon, too. That means oh, he's finally open to us now. I feel awful for prying into his personal affairs. No way in hell he's abusing her. Yeah, exactly. Finally, people, you know. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her, her mother. mother yeah. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her, though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjet. It's possible. It's possible. Hold on a sec. Do we even know if she has a palace? That's uh, as well. Let's about. check. Futaba. <clears throat> the Futaba Sakura that <clears throat> lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. Is that going to be enough? Oi! Say. What the? <laughs> that hit. She's got one. So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. Where's Morgana? I haven't seen him for some time. He's been left at the house. So, ever since we went inside Boss's <laughs> house? Somewhere around there. He'll be fine though. He's a cat after all. The trains are gonna be shutting down <laughs> for the night soon, so we should probably be heading home. Bad news, bad news. We have to go to school in the morning after all. There's that. Sucks. Oh, right. Yeah, urgent, urgent assembly. Urgent assembly. Yeah. An assembly? What about? About the psychotic breakdowns. Shujin has been garnering a lot of attention Medjet. ever since Medjet called out the Phantom Thieves. So, they need to remind us not to say arbitrary stuff online and add more fuel to the fire. <laughs> we gotta meet up for every goddamn little thing. <sighs> Talk about a pain in the ass. <laughs> I mean, it is our fault. 
Yeah, the anyway, fact that let's <laughs> contact each other afterward. Cool. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her, though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjet. Now, hold on a sec. Do we even know if she has a palace? Let's check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. Is that gonna be enough? What the? She's got one. So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. <laughs> yep, that's the cut there. <laughs> it's... All right. Where did Morgana go? All right. Should write something. This has been a very long video. <laughs> a lot of content, a lot of progress in the story. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Thank you so much for watching my uh, video once again on Persona 5 Royal today. Hope, hope you guys really enjoyed it. If you guys did enjoy my video, be sure to smash the like button, comment, share those good things, and see more content on me doing more uh, Persona 5 Royal videos like this in the future. However, if you guys are new to the channel, consider hitting that subscribe button and join the DRP Guild today so you won't miss a single video from my channel, guys. Whether it's gaming videos, whether it's reaction videos, or whether it's live streams. So as always guys, this is your boy Dina signing out and have a nice day, stay awesome, and I'll see you in the next video guys. So until then, peace.